as you know, uh, this is an emotive issue to kind of as far as land issues. Uh, uh, speculators coming to the country, grabbing land. We have issues uh, with uh, our borders. We have a dispute over land with the counties, uh, with the international borders. So today's function was to, uh, function was to discuss that, uh, is to sensitize the public and get legislation that is going to to actually improve the Community Land Act that is now in place. Trukana is primarily a pastoralist uh, society. So the core, the core livelihood here is pastoralism. So we need to protect the land that makes livestock to survive. We've said in this meeting, we will develop Trukana will allow infrastructure, will allow lapset, will build nice cities, but not at the detriment of pastoralism. We are pastoralism in Botswana, is thriving in, uh, in Ethiopia. We must protect our life, uh, our livestock, our lives. 80% of Turkanas are pastoralists. They rely on livestock. So we need to protect them. That is our constituency. In, in this county. We need to protect them, but we don't want to discourage development in our towns. We don't want to discourage agriculture. We don't want to discourage natural resource exploitation. All those will be put in place, but not at the detriment of pushing out the camel owners, the sheep owners, the, car, the cattle owners. We need that development. It's a viable development in our terrain here, in our ecosystem. We need it to thrive alongside the conventional way of doing things. Everybody wants modernity, but at the same time, it doesn't work with the kind of aridity we have. We want to support our land, I mean, our people. In this land of Trukana, which is 77,000 square kilometers, to get so much from out, out of it, to get uh, agriculture, to get the livestock uh, you know, they want to keep, to exploit their minerals, to develop their towns, so that in a wholesome, Trukana is modern, but preserving a viable economic 